Why do you want to ride your motorcycle to California? It's just a trip I always uh, thought it wanted to say. I always thought about it for a, long, for a lot of years and I just never did it, but I fear I need to do it now. Well, what do you want to see when you go out there? Really, it's just going for the ride. I just want to go to the West Coast. I've been on the East Coast all my life, so I want to go to the West Coast. Yesterday we left on our trip to California. We're gonna be going for 21 days, and today is day two. First day we rode 528 miles. We made it to Eureka, Missouri. We came through a lot of rain. The rain's probably about 40% of the trip, but we still had a good time. We just put our rain suits on and kept on going. Having a good time, had a great time yesterday, and today is about 7.30, 8 o'clock in the morning, and we're trying to figure out where we're gonna go next. So, just got through taking a shower, we're gonna get the bikes loaded up. Well, they got, my Uncle Reggie has his bike loaded up. I'm gonna get my bike loaded up. Daddy's, Daddy's in the shower. We'll be leaving in a minute to get breakfast. And we're gonna end up a little bit further down the road on our way to California. Thank you. All right, traveling tall, you out of here? <laughs> yes, I okay, have. you have, have a good day. Nice day. Thank you. St. Louis and Kansas City. So we stopped at the Midway Travel Plaza. It's an old school truck stop looking place. Pretty neat. But that's where we are. We're getting gas and we will, we're gonna get back on the road, keep riding. Hopefully we can make it to Kansas City. If I'm not gonna, I need to get some lunch before then. But we're gonna make it to Kansas City and then on to our next destination. We made it, we are in Salina, Kansas and made it to the KOA and uh, Good. It was a good ride. Let me zoom out here. Didn't realize I was that close in on you. All right, so this is a KOA cabin and it has, you see this bed here. It has a full size bed, like a full, maybe a queen size bed there. And it has two bunks right there. And a TV. And little thing a little table and you have these chairs really nice air condition up top and you go outside and and we're right here beside the little lake which brought a bunch of mosquitoes so we got a we got a fire going over there that's uh, uncle reggie and daddy over there Today is day three. We're in Salina, Kansas. Reggie's out there cleaning off his windshield. Today we're gonna to get riding. Get about 300 miles down the road. Maybe four or five, it depends on how we feel, but gotta get some lunch first. Then we're gonna get on bikes and get riding. All right, so we're here in Kansas. Just a little bit outside of Hayes. And uh, we're on our way to Denver. We're gonna stop in Stratus, Colorado. We got 300 miles to go. Very windy out here. Let me fix this. What's going on? All right. Very windy out here. Motorcycles, you kind of lean into it, whatever. My bike is so dirty. Look at that thing. Yeah, that thing is filthy. But when I get to where I'm going, we get it cleaned off. Just out stretching our legs. About to get back on the bikes and get riding.
what I was trying to show you earlier. Rock the mountains, check it out. Look how nice that looks. Traveling Tall is brought to you by Custom Dynamics, Zippers Performance, Chromeworks, Redline Oil, Volunteer Audio, and Let's Roll. We about to ride, we about to ride. I got to ride. It's that time of year again. Traveling Talls Run to the Hills 3. We are ready. And I can't wait to have you guys down to Knoxville, Tennessee. We are going to ride. We are going to ride. The host hotel will be the Hilton Garden Inn in Knoxville, Tennessee, 6200 Paper Mill Drive. Click the link below in the description to get a discounted rate. The banquet is on Saturday night and tickets will be on sale to the banquet. Of course, we're gonna have t-shirts provided and a giveaway for those who attend the banquet. We only have 130 tickets that we can sell. Last year, they sold out quickly. This year, I'm expecting it to do the same. I'll be giving you some more details on the ride that'll be coming up, so you make sure that you hit that subscribe button and turn on all notifications to be notified so you can receive up to the minute information about the rides that we're gonna be riding at Traveling Tall Friends of Hills 3. Guys, I hope to see you there. Don't forget, mark your calendar for June 9th, 10th, and 11th for Traveling Tall Friends of Hills 3. Last year we had a blast, this year's gonna be even better. Like, share, and subscribe, keep gliding, and as always, have a blessed day.